Hello, YouTube pipe spilkers. Scott the Nitrate Piper here. And uh, here we are in summer in Southern California. It's in the low 50s, maybe 40s tonight. So I am dressed warmly. We just had a um, kind of a big storm. It was Hurricane Hillary that came up from the Gulf of Mexico, or not the Gulf of Mexico, uh, Sea of Cortez, and uh, Pacific Ocean went up Baja, California, and uh, ended up becoming a tropical storm, and then coming into here, um, to, to California and Arizona, it mostly hit the desert. So, didn't really hit the mountains. It, it, the center of it, mainly the main force of it, went a little east of me. But we got about five inches of rain and about um, probably eight hours. And then to the east of me by about 10, 15 miles, I think they got about 10 inches of rain. So now it's stayed really cold. Everything's wet. Um, so yeah, I'm out here. Um, but no damage right here. But some people in the mountains did lose their homes up in the mountains where I live. in that area where the 10 inches fell. So um, people were people were definitely hurting after this storm up here. Um, I count my blessings that I'm not one of them, um, but I'm gonna do what I can to help people out. So anyway, um, just wanted to report back. I took a trip to San Diego before the storm hit So I'm going to have some brief videos here of the sites um, yeah, that I saw down there. Just some quick sites, including a little visit to Liberty Tobacco, what I purchased there. All right, uh, so enjoy. Right, so this is the uh, Del Mar racetrack. It's kind of right over there on the other side of those uh, pilings there. That's, that's the railroad tracks. And uh, they're doing some kind of event there, it looks like. Uh, but they have the San Diego County Fair here, and they also do uh, concerts. They got a big concert venue, and then a, then the racetrack. That's those sta stands right there. The racetrack is just to the left of those stands. So I was hearing them announce races earlier. Um, I don't know if they're still doing it right now. I think the event is starting soon or something. So there you go. All right, now walking out on the beach. There's uh, Highway 1. Goes the length of California pretty much. Um, so this is the other side of where that big lagoon was and the Del Mar racetrack. So here's the Pacific Ocean. Yes, the Pacific Ocean. And uh, very clear, pleasant day today. It's right around probably 75 degrees here on the beach. A little warm for the beach usually actually, but I uh, can't complain, it's beautiful. So, uh, so yeah, here's the sun. <laughs> Somebody's houses are right here. So. so yeah, pretty nice. This is one of the smaller beaches. My bag I bought. But uh, yeah, this is a nice little mall here. You know, um, just right off the I-5 freeway. Look at this little bench outside. It's made of a Ford tailgate, kind of cool. So, uh, this is it, Liberty Tobacco. There it is. All right, so what did I get in my bag at Liberty Tobacco? I got, open the bag really quick. Look at that, I opened it so fast. So I got a corn cob pipe that I've been wanting for quite a while. This is a country gentleman. Um, I love the shape of this, this little round sort of billiard shape-ish. I love that. And uh, this little bent stem on it. So I've been wanting one of these for a long time and I saw one there. Good old Missouri Mersham. And I was almost out of Zippo fluid. Been going through a lot since I've been smoking outside in the wind using my Zippo. And then I got a little tobacco, of course. This is called Tori. And it's a mild English. So I'll be taking a look at that. Here's their little logo. Sorry I couldn't go in and film in there. I just didn't feel comfortable doing it. So uh, anyway, there you go. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed that little vignette. My apologies again, I didn't go into Liberty Tobacco.
and film. Um, it's a nice little shop. They've got a couple of chairs right up front, um, lounge chairs. So their cigar lounge is right there uh, at, when you enter the store. And then they have a decent amount of cigars, mostly cigars, and then a lot of blends that they uh, they mixed um, and uh, blended. And a few pipes in there too. They've got both estate pipes and then newer pipes. They had some Savinelli's, uh, some Rossi's, and uh, had some other ones too. I think Nordings in there. So I had a good time. I will be stopping there again, of course, next time I go down there. So um, hope all is well with you. And uh, I shall touch base again soon, hopefully under a little warmer conditions. I kind of want summer to come back just for a little bit, a little bit. Talk to you all later.